Good evening. Good evening, Nigel. Thanks for having me on. No, not at all. A welcome. So, you know, we've got Gito Harry, uh, a Remainer, uh, pro-China, uh, pro-open borders, uh, now acting as the Prime Minister's press spokesman. Uh, and yet we have Kwasi Kwarteng and others going around the place saying everything's fine. It's all sorted. We're getting on with the job. Let me ask you straight. Is Boris Johnson back on track? I don't think he's re ever really been off track, Nigel. Um, I, th I, th I think there's plenty of achievements that the Prime Minister's had so far. And yes, of course, we've had a difficult period at the moment. But I think the things that we put forward to people at the election, I've certainly still got a lot of faith in those things. And yes, at, at times we need a bit of a reset. There's been a clear out at number 10. Um, and there's lots of plans there, lots of new people coming in. So I wouldn't say he's uh, gone off track, Nigel. No, I think actually this is part of a... Uh, a new start, really, for us all. When do you think of what people in Bassett Law voted for, uh, not just in the referendum, but when they voted for you in December 2019, they didn't vote for the kind of politics that the Prime Minister's new press spokesman represents, did they? Yeah, I, th I think the, the key point here as well is, is that the Prime Minister's press secretary isn't a politician. He's not a member of Parliament. He's not there to set policy. He's there to do a, a job in communications. Now,